Hey, can you subscribe to my channel, please? No, really, the link is in the description. <clears throat> There's good ways and bad ways to market yourself. Today, Mike goes over the good ways to promote your channel. What is up everyone, my name is Zesty Mike, and today we're gonna talk about promoting yourself and marketing yourself in the proper way. Given that VidCon is just around the corner, I started to think of ways that we can market ourselves and actually network with other creators there. Unfortunately, one of the most common things I see on the comment section is, hey, can you subscribe to my channel, or hey, can you check out my channel? Now, there are good ways and there are bad ways to go about this. Now, since I was talking about VidCon earlier, let's bring that into example. How will you want to market yourself and represent yourself at VidCon if you're going there to network with others and potentially grow your channel? Chances are you're not gonna run around screaming, subscribe to my channel or comment on my channel or watch my videos or whatever. Instead, you'd probably want to network with others, talk with others, get to know the person, share your interests, and if it is something that they might be interested in, leave them your channel and that they can check it out when they have their own time. Whenever I meet a new creator, I want to see what they do to see if it's someone I'd be interested in watching or potentially even work with. Now online is actually no different. No one wants to be bombarded with requests to check out other people's channels, instead they want to feel like people are actually watching the video for them and as they get to know the person and find out more about them, if they find out they're a creator, chances are they're going to want to check out their work and see what type of material they make for their channel. So be a friend, talk to the person, share your passion and be a fellow creator, not a spammer. Er, er, er. So how do you go about doing this? Leave comments that are relatable to the video, not about yourself. Leave comments that are relatable to the video, but also show the creator that you are a creator as well. Now don't blatantly promote yourself, but instead sneak in little tidbits about your own channel or your own style that might relate with the creator that you're watching. If you start standing out from the rest, then that is when you're actually gonna be noticed. So now that online is out of the way, let's go back to meeting in person. One of the biggest tips I can give you is to keep business cards on you. They're very cheap to get made done, even if you don't no graphics, they are pre-made templates where you just fill in your information, click save, and then order as many as you want. So this way, when you're talking to a person, you can leave them with a card, and if they're interested in checking out your channel, they can choose to do so. They can have all your information and easily be able to find your channel. And just a tip, make sure they can easily find your channel. I can't tell you how many times I've gotten business cards that just have no information on it. It has their name or something. I search and nothing comes up. So leave a channel link, do something so that they can actually find it. I know that sounds silly, but it's, it needs to be said. Now, of course, ideally, you want the person to be able to remember your channel without actually writing it down or giving them a business card, but for some of us, it's not that easy. I'm talking to you, gamer dude, XX327, Xbox, YouTube, controller, and things and stuff, YouTube, blah, blah, blah. That's my channel name, dot com. So carry business cards on you and make sure it's not something that they're actually gonna throw away. You don't wanna be that guy writing your channel name on a napkin. But anyways, guys, that's it for me today. In short, just be sure to be yourself don't be spammy keep business cards on you and relate with the creator because then the creator will want to relate with you if you want to see more of my tips and tricks you can click the link in the sidebar and of course if you want to see more of me you can check me out in the links below I post up videos every single day now for next week guys I want to do something a little bit differently instead of putting up something that I care about I want to see what you guys want to know what you guys want to discuss whether it's filmmaking tips editing tips or just YouTube tips in general. I have covered a lot, so make sure you check the sidebar before you ask a question because typically a lot of them have already been answered. But if you have something in particular that you would like me to answer, be sure to leave the comments down below and I'll be sure to tackle it next week. At least one of the topics, not all the topics. I'll tackle the other topics in the future as we move on. So anyways, I want to start answering your questions and uh, we'll see you next week. See ya. Impulse is produced by the Freedom Network. Ever wanted to earn revenue from your videos? Freedom offers a great partnership program which includes access to hundreds of thousands of audio tracks, sponsorships with great partners, and most importantly, a no lock-in contract. You can leave at any time for any reason. We accept everyone, both big and small. For more information, click here or visit the link in the video description.